Magdalene. And his kitten coming in. Now he's washing his ass. Hi and welcome back to my channel. I am Lucy and today you are watching my top 10 winter lipsticks. So these lipsticks are all completely different, they are from different brands and they have different formulas. So some of them are lipsticks, some of them are liquid lipsticks, and some of them are lip glosses, some lip lacquers. I actually think I've covered everything. My first one is this, this is the Rimmel Colour Rush in the shade Keep Moving. Is just very moisturizing uh, yeah it's very pigmented for what the product is it's which is like um almost a very tinted lip balm so these are extremely magnificent for winter um, obviously the staying power is not fantastic because it is it is just a lip balm basically but honestly it is incredible the next shade is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in shade London and like the Rimmel one it is a moisturising product that has more staying power than the Rimmel one. Very orangey based brown it's a perfect nude, I think, for most skin colours. Um, but I just really love this one. It's just, it's so cute. You can, oh, I've got a spot by, oh. But I absolutely love this colour. I just think it's a perfect neutral shade. Adore it. Next colour is this. It is the Little Mix Collection. So, Collection is a brand in the UK and Little Mix did a collab with them and created these. These were a few years ago and I got the shade Perry and it is this gorgeous, gorgeous purple. I just think it's such a cute shade. I adore it and they are super, super cheap. Um, and it's shade Perry. Perry is my bae. Such bae. My next colour is a little bit of a wacky colour but I adore it nonetheless. It was in my November favourites which I will link here. Uh, and it is the uh, Makeup Revolution Atomic Serpent. <laughs> very Christmassy colour, I absolutely adore it. Um, yeah, not really much I can say about this colour other than it is fantastic and super, super cheap. Um, perfect for Halloween, perfect for Christmas. So the next colour is Divine Wine by Maybelline and I was wearing this in my previous videos. I adore this shade, it's just a dark red, yet again, perfect for the upcoming season. This is one of my favourite colours that I am wearing right now. It is just, just divine. See what I did there. As you can see, it does come off. But it is super moisturising. Um, it's moisturising but it's a matte finish, it's the weirdest thing. You could reapply this just over the top without having to do anything. Um, yeah, I just absolutely love it and now we're going to take it off and we are halfway through. My lips are so goddamn dry. So now I can move on to my more moisturising products. So these I'm now going to do are lip glosses. So the first one I have is my Collection Deluxe Lip Lacquer in the shade Dancing Queen. Is Dancing 
queen. I realise I'm going to have to get very, very close to the camera for this. So it's very um, dewy. It's highly moisturising. It was a bit of a pain to sort of spread over the lips. But I think it's a rather nice, very festive colour. It's very sticky. It's a very tacky lip gloss. I also have this in... Um, in sparkling lights which is a red colour so the next colour is my Reve makeup revolution lip amplification lip gloss this is in the shade limitless this is for people who are not afraid to wear those dark colours and embrace that dark side let me tell you, my lips are absolutely loving this product. It is so moisturising. Obviously, this is a lip gloss, so the colour is going to come off. But the good news is it's so easy to reapply. I love this colour. I think it just suits my pale skin. So this is uh, a grey. It looks not grey. Oh, look at that. Um, it looks not grey in the camera, but trust me, in IRL, it is grey. The last lip gloss product is this Jumbo Lip Gloss Stick from e.l.f. in the shade Flirty and Girly. <laughs> What I love about this one is it's unbelievably glittery, um, which is yet again perfect for this time of year where glitter is everything. So moisturising on the lips. Am I going to have lips at the end of this video? Who knows, but I've got two more products to show you. Final two products are liquid lipsticks and I'm going to start with the lighter shade NYX Lingerie. I've got the shade Embellishment. But I just, I do think this is a perfect shade for me. Um, it's just unfortunate that the formula is very drying. Um, I just I just can't love liquid lipsticks. I want to love them and I think they look absolutely incredible on other people. But on me, I hate the, the line lip look. The way it just sticks to like every dry patch. The last colour I'm going to show you is the Makeup Academy Velvet Lip Lacquer. I'm going to have tea first because this is just going to go everywhere. This is a black lipstick. If you were looking for a dupe for Kylie Jenner, maybe give this a try. This is the black Actually, that didn't turn out too bad. Um, so now that it's dry, it looks better. But what I love about this is... Okay, so it's not dry completely yet, but... It is just incredible. So all of my top 10 favourite lip products of 2016. I hope you enjoyed. I will link all of the names down below just in case you missed one or you want to try to look it up online. Um, I will also put the prices of what I have found them to be down below as well so you can check them out. All of them are under £7 so you are not spending a fortune on these products. They are absolutely incredible and I would recommend every single last one of them. If you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and all that biz and I will see you next time. Bye!